dun 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 in the ice of mounts whatever the hell that place is called what is that place called? is Gamora's doom okay well fine in the ice of Isgamore's tomb. Dun 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 dun. Oh, well, that kind of killed that. <laughs> Hello and welcome to uh, the next step of our Skyrim adventure. This is, I I think this is actually the last mission now of the companions that we're going to do. Um, I'm not going to say which part of the video this is because, uh, as I was uh, filming and uploading bits and pieces uh, that came up recently. Uh, Sean uh, sent me a message to politely tell me that I'd got the numbers wrong. So I was like, oh, okay, fair enough then. Hang on, that's a massive mountain. We're just going this little bit here. God, it shows I haven't done this in a long time. That's a bit anticlimactic. I was going to have to climb to the top of that. First of all, are there any elves in here? Because if there are elves in here, I'll use the I'll use Wuthrad, but there's no point if there aren't any elves. You know what? Whoosh! <laughs> yeah, I'm up for this. I've not done anything with two-handed weapons yet, but you know what? It's fine. Take some names. Oh. Here we go. This is the resting place of Iskramor and its most trusted generals. You should be cautious. Um, why do we need to be cautious? I mean, they're all dead, aren't they? The original companions. Their finest warriors rest with Iskramor. You'll have to prove yourselves to them. It's not that you're intruding. I'd wager they've actually expected us. They just want to be sure that you're worthy. Be ready for an honorable battle. Well, um... Are you coming with me? Kodlak was right. I let vengeance rule my heart. I regret nothing of what we did at Driftshade. But I can't go any further with my mind fogged or my heart grieved. Well, that sounds like a really, really weak cop out, mate. You can do better than that. Prove you better by coming in with me. No? Okay, fine. You be like that. Well, how do I get inside then? Return Wuthra to Iskramor. It should open the way. Oh, so I've got this great axe and I don't get Until to use next it. Time. Typical. I'm taking the coins. Right, well. Alright, let's go. I would talk to you, Farkas and Leia, but I don't really. Hang on. Oh, it's underneath. Well. How do the giant spiders and the rats get in? And you know, if there's like a tunnel that they're all ca they are using to get into the places like this. Never. Yeah, well, you're a ghost, and uh, ancient Nord axe. I'm taking the arrow. A single arrow. Oh yeah. You may. It's a bit strange how, you know, ghosts apparently have weapons and can use them that can hurt us. If they were using magic or something, that would make a bit more sense, but, you know. And that you'd have to use, say, magic back on them, but. Okay, I get that they're the com their companions, so. It's like, yeah, they'd all be using swords and shields, really. They're like. But, you know, you're a ghost. I'm.
Lots of lady ghosts. Killing the lady ghosts. Nothing up there. Any more around here? No, I think we're ready for the next the next room. Spiders. How do spiders get in here? Well, at least you did something, Farkas. Let's have a little quick potion. Cure disease. I'm still annoyed about that. It's like Argonians don't have 100% poison resistance in this game. That's just... That's a swizz. That's like the, the only plus side. There's not enough water that you need to go swimming in that you really are... That you really need to... to worry about the whole being able to breathe underwater thing. this is a relatively interesting looking dungeon still it's like in terms of the stuff I've, I've gone through several dungeons and they're all basically that they all have a very similar format There's lots of reused assets in terms of uh, in terms of uh, what they've got in there like barrows and so this looks like a lot like feet of course you will mate of course you will you're a ghost you're not going anywhere it's, it's obviously it looks a lot like people's barrows but they've done them Retiled the colours a little bit uh, to make it look a little bit more like, uh, well, like it's been frozen, which is kind of nice. Makes it a little bit more interesting to look at as we run around. up a level by being hit by stuff, so that's quite cool. Die, companion ghost, die. Yes, I am aware of the irony of killing you while you being a ghost. Uh, let's have a little look-see at what we can level up. Um, back to health, I suppose. And... It's actually slightly annoying. They give you the uh, the badass Wuthrad axe and they don't let you use it. It's like, oh, yeah, yeah, no, no. oh, you need to stick it in the door. Oh, you need to do the door. Okay. Hmm, a lever in a ghosty tomb. I wonder what'll happen if I pull this. Spooky noise. Oh, I've just opened the door. You know what? And here come the ghosts. Okay. Yes. Death does come for me. But I bought her dinner last time, so it's her turn to buy me dinner. Oh yeah! Kills for days. You just keep barging into me. Two hand foot. Yeah. Nah, nothing there. So far, it's not. Where's Farkas gone? Fine. I'm not bothered about him anyway, but it's like. Yeah. Would have been nice if he said something. Oh. 
Hey, God, like what I mean? Ghost. Greeting, shield brother. Kodlak, is that you? Of course. My fellow Harbingers and I have been warming ourselves here, trying to evade Husey. But there's no one else here. You see only me because your heart knows only me as the companion's leader. Oh, that's bollocks. I'd wager old Vignar could see half a dozen of my predecessors. And I see them all. The ones in Sovngarde. The ones trapped with me in Hirsi's realm. And they all see you. You've brought honor to the name of the Companions. We won't soon forget it. Well, Vilka said you can still be cured. Um, not quite sure how, seeing as you're dead and your soul should be with Hirsi now, but, um... Yeah, Vilka's reckon it can happen. Did he now? I can only hope. You still have the witch's heads. Excellent. Throw one of them into the fire. It will release their magic. For me, at least. Um, yeah, alright. Don't know why I'm still carrying around five witches' heads, but yeah. Stick the head in the fire. That is... No sign of him. That was... Okay, I get what was supposed to have happened there, but that was just silly. The wolf spirit came out of you and I killed it. Greetings, shield brother. Why are you saying greetings to me again? We've just killed that beast in front of you. We've not gone anywhere. And so slain the beast inside of me. Yeah, I know. I thank you for this gift. The other Harbingers remain trapped by Hirsi. Well, Perhaps I... from Sovngarde, the heroes of old can join me in their rescue. The harrowing of the hunting grounds. It would be a battle of such triumph. And perhaps someday you'll join us in that battle. But for today, return to your master. Triumph in your victory. And lead the companions to further glory. Hear that? He wants me to be in charge. And now he's disappeared. Did I hear right? Did he say you were to lead the companions? Uh, too right. He did indeed. You've earned the right. Your strength and honor are apparent to all. And it's my oh. honor to be first to address you as Harbinger. I don't Let's sound too impressed. Honor. You know, I'm just, you know, I've gone down loads of Something stuff on my own. Shifted in the moons, brother. What? Am I over oh my god, I'm over encumbered again! You know, for a playthrough where it's trying to be like as lit as un over encumbered as possible, I seem to have more crap on me than ever. Repeat that. Okay, that is a crazy looking mural. Now, is there a uh, word of power thing in here? I would have thought there was, but I don't think there is. I think they've, I think they've set it up that way. Alright, well. Uh, is there a quick way back? There nearly always is. Something has shifted in the moons, brother. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Shield of Iskramor. Um, yeah, I'll have that. I shall take all of that. Um. Oh, God. Probably shouldn't have taken all of that now. I don't want that. Uh, I don't want that. 10, 11. Don't want that. Mm 
Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Hang on, what's, what's the things of sure grip? What do they do? I don't remember. See, so, this is what happens when you don't read stuff. Uh, apparel, sure grip. Two handed attacks. Oh, I don't care about two handed attacks. Uh, I've got anything rubbish in here. Well, I don't really need these anymore, do I? Get rid of them. Morbid reminder of killing witches. Now, I don't know where Farkas is, but I'm just going to leave him wherever he is. He can, he can stay in this dungeon. I'm sure he's going to have a great time. We're just going to rob the dead, because robbing the dead is fun. And they can't stop us. Ha 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 ha. There's our quick way out. Because backtracking is too much effort. I'll have my axe back now, mate. Oh my god, encumbered again! Right, do you have a... Those outcomes I never have. Cr Hang on, potions. Oh, I don't want them. Uh, I can live without that. I can live without that. I can live without that. Good about that. And, uh. Good about that. There we go. Because I'm not running all the way back to. Thingamajig, your Vascar. From here. Too much effort. I mean, this is primarily meant to be like a chill out run, a chill out run thing. So we don't. I'm not going to push the bounds of insanity by running all the way there and back again. I'm going to run to places that I need to go to. Places that are brand new. <sighs> Rain. Hard like white man is the lead to rest. I know. May his soul live forever in the halls of Southern God. You're right. I work for Bellafield. Don't care, mate. Never. You know what's wrong with Skyrim these days? Everyone is obsessed with death. Yes, because death is awesome. Hail Sithis. Not that I don't know. That's it. Now I'm going to leave. Took me in and helped me turn my life around. Alright, well, I think I'm popular enough among the companions I could probably go to Dragon and report uh, what's going on with uh, the dragon and the Helgen, but you know, I think I think for now what we'll do is we'll we'll give it a, we'll give it a little brief rest. Alright, uh... Very, very surreal. Friends like you are hard to find and very valuable to me. Thank you. Is there anything that comes up here, or is it all just a case of what do you now mean, I'm in? Friend? 
I've been tending to the warriors of your Basker for as long as I can remember. Got I us see here. everything, hear everything, and know everything. Well, then that makes you fantastic, doesn't it? La di da. Does that make this my room then? Does this become my room? I think it does. This is now my room. I'm going to leave the unusual gem because that's going to start off a whole thing that's going to bother me if I pick it up. I don't like having unfinished quests on my... Uh... Right. Uh... Ooh. Dwarven Greatsword. I think that's actually it. Um, let's find... I mean... A fairly unceremonious end to everything, but... Let's find, uh... Someone. Oh, I'm a good keeper of secrets. Have to be. In this hall. I think that's it. I think that's everyone. I think that's it. Everything in the companions is done now. Okay. Um, right. I'm caught a little bit by surprise. I thought it'd at least be like a final conversation to I'd have with someone. Not for Big Nor. Took me in and oh, leave me, me alone. I've already spoken to you. When the Empire surrendered to the old Mary Dominion, they shamed us all. Shut up, Pete. Okay, well, I... Yeah, well... That's it. It's done. Alright. Well, what I'm going to do is... Uh, I think I'll cut this off here. It's a slightly shorter video. Um, and then what I'll do is I'll reboot this all back in a minute. Once I get my thoughts, I'll do a little uh, roundup of uh, the companions before we uh, move on to... Uh, Which is probably going to be Dawn, which is going to be Dawn Guard, because uh, it's all set up for Dawn Guard now. Okay, right, well, I'll see you in a little bit. So, hello. Um, this is Sean the. The Argonian, sitting in his, well, standing in his room at uh, Yorvaskara as a harbinger of the Companions. Now, I just wanted to talk in brief, uh, just before we move on to the next bit. Um, this is only going to be a fairly short summary. I'll probably just tack this on to the end of another video. Um, in terms of the Companions, it was fairly short. There are a lot of quite big leaps that happened. It felt like they had... It's, it felt like they wanted to kind of push werewolves as a thing, and rather than like have its own set, have it be its own separate, you know, you meet like a group of werewolves, um, calling themselves say say the inner circle. You have it still be the same characters, you know, but they rather, but rather than be part of the companions, they're just their own thing, and you introduce them like it's just part of like a random quest. You end up, uh, it's kind of they just kind of stuck it with the companions and it became and felt like a fairly low rent fighters guild now I think I'm pretty and I think it's I know from Oblivion the fighters guild was probably a touch longer than it needed to be in terms of the amount of missions you did and there's what um, I think uh, somewhere I think it's around sort of 12 to 15 missions in the fighters guild quite a few in fact because you've got to get you've got to get promoted up like some like six or seven ranks and then at one point you get demoted as well, and so there's quite a few missions to go through. And yeah, each one's slightly different, and okay, yes, it all results in like, go here, kill this, come back. In a few cases it was like, okay, go here with this person, protect them, you know, escort missions and stuff. But you know, there was enough variety that made it kind of feel fairly interesting. 
Now, with this one, it was really short. It's kind of, there's what, five story missions and uh, three radiant missions? Oh, don't, no, no, don't, don't pan around, I'm doing my talking. But this is it. Mmm, apple pie, I'll have that in a minute. But this is it. I mean, in terms of where it was, this felt a little, it just felt too short. Um, for this being like a main faction quest, this was short, and it it wasn't that it was unenjoyable, it's just it really needed more development. It needed something to make it bulk out a little bit, make it feel like it was worth doing. I, I went from being an abs a brand new nobody in the Companions to being part of the Inner Circle in, what, two missions? One of them being a Radiant quest? It's kind of... It, it's nothing, and then the Silver Hand... Well, what, what were they? They were just bandits who had a sil who had silver weapons. It's like you, you know, you could have done something a bit more interesting there. You could have given them, say, uh, armor. Sil you could give them silver armor, because it's like, haha, werewolves can't touch us now. Because if they touch us, they'll hurt their hands. Or maybe not all the silver hand have that, but maybe like you know, their leaders had that or something. Because I did say two radiant quests in which I killed two leaders, and there's like, a couple of other leaders as well. But it's like, you know what, no, you didn't, there was nothing different about them. They might as well have just been bandits. And you could have done exactly the same missions, but instead of calling them Silver Hand, you call them bandits. Bandits have gone to this room, or to this area, kill them. You know, you don't get anything extra in terms of story that makes this feel more alive and more real. So, if I had to pick, um, I'd... I wouldn't, I wouldn't call this necessarily bad, but by the same token, it's very underdeveloped. It really needed a bit more a, it needed a bit more story to bulk it out and make it feel like it was more along the lines of what we what we would want really because it's kind of I what I've got all I've got left now is um going on radiant quests for the companions to earn extra gold. I'm not going to do any of that. I don't think I ever have done any of that. And I don't think there's any plans for me to ever do that in the future. I, I don't. I tend not to do the companion stuff because I don't like being forced into being a werewolf. Now, you know, but I'm now a werewolf, and I'm going to have to be a werewolf for the rest of the game because I don't think you can get it cured. Um, there, there probably is a cure out there that I just don't know about or can't remember off the top of my head, but I don't necessarily want to be a werewolf all the way through. And yeah, but now I am, and that's kind of annoying. It's a, it's a nuisance. That's all. I know they wanted to kind of push the whole become a werewolf thing, but uh, yeah. So in, in summary, the companions, it has a really, really good idea. It's a really nice, neat idea of reintroducing werewolves and being a, a different take on the kind of fighters guild, by being like rather than being like a professional unit, it's more of a. It's a Nordic fighters guild, people drinking and brawling and doing all that stuff, but they kind of didn't really do it very well. They kind of tried to blend the two things, and now it's just kind of... It's a strange amalgamation that isn't really that interesting. But it's kind of... I'm interested in it because it seems like a really good idea, but by the same token, I'm not that interested in it. That this is like the, the I think the third or fourth time out of how many playthroughs I've actually gone and finished all the companion stuff. So uh, take that as you will. Okay, right. I'm gonna go sell, sell some stuff, power level my smithing for a bit, so I can kit out my character a little bit better, and then my next adventure. And I'm not going to finish do the main story just yet. But is God oh, Dawn God is the only thing that's been going next, and uh, we'll go from there. Right, cheerio.